Greetings. I'm Ali Asani, professor of Indo-Muslim and Islamic religion and cultures at Harvard, and I welcome you to my course, Understanding Islam and Contemporary Muslim Societies. When we hear a new story about religious conflict or coexistence, it's easy to retreat to simplistic or even exaggerated claims about what this or that religion believes or argues or does. But religions do not believe or argue or do anything. So how can we get past these reductive descriptions of religions? When confronted with conflicting information, how are we to know what a religion really is? Can we turn to the example of a founding figure, the message in a sacred text, or do our sources need to be more complex and varied when trying to understand religions. By showing you how to examine a religious tradition, specifically Islam, through the cultural studies approach, this course will help you grapple more effectively with the nature of religion and the diverse claims made about it or in its name. The cultural studies approach is premised on the notion that constructions of religion are intricately embedded in all dimensions and contexts of human experience. Historical, political, economic, social, literary, artistic, and so on. As these contexts evolve and change, religious ideas and institutions change. As a result, religions are not only dynamic, but are also marked by internal diversity. Asking what, a religious, asking what a religion does or teaches no longer becomes a viable question. Instead, religion should be studied by focusing on how people, influenced by the realities of their lives, practice, interpret, and construct the tradition. In order to highlight and distinguish between competing claims, we should be asking questions such as, who is interpreting the tradition, and in which context, and drawing upon what authority. This course will focus on the Islamic tradition because currently there's a plethora of stereotypical and highly politicized constructions of Islam in media and political and social spaces. We will examine appeals to prophetic or scriptural authority, the development of post-prophetic authorities in contemporary times, including the nation state, and specific case studies of countries such as Saudi Arabia, Nigeria, Iran, Turkey, Egypt, Pakistan, Afghanistan, and the United States that will highlight the importance of cultural context. By the time we finish these case studies, you will better understand the complexities of Islam and its role in various societies. You will also appreciate the role played by ideologies such as jihad, colonialism, nationalism, secularism, and globalization in shaping the diverse and sometimes contradictory ways in which Muslims interpret and practice their faith today. Looking forward to seeing you in my class.